get ready with the anchor. That's, that's fine. That's fine. Uh, if you want to drop them down to me as I go, just drop one more. I'm going to slowly drip these in. If you could drop the treasure chest, that'd be great. Because that is the trinkets in it. Fifteen. Okay, don't leave the rest on board. I'm gonna sell these just because they're here, but uh, now I'm gonna buy the flag. Wait. Oh, I have to buy these things. Never mind. I was like, why can't I buy it? Beans. Now we'll just take this around. We'll finish the voyage. If you want to get some voyages. I can probably get one more. Yeah, where should we put those? Empty ones here. So we got to go now to Fetcher's Rest. If we want, we can cancel it and drop another one. It's just a riddle. It's just a riddle. One, two, and Fetcher's. And the rule of action reaches. Right. Let's see if it's a chapter. Nope, doesn't. Is it a chapter one? It is? Okay, then we'll do it. If that means there's more. Um, let's see. Where should we go first? We have to go to. Uh, flames end, and then I guess to Ash and Reaches, and then we'll come back up to uh, Fetchers. Alrighty. Why are we moving forward? I'm gonna take holes there. But I didn't because I'm cool. Like, how would you do Discord, uh, Burrito, if you are on a Xbox? Does, does Xbox have a Discord app? Does... I know they were talking about it, but I don't know if they do. Okay. Yeah. I know some people use their phones, but that's a 
I can see that being a major pain in the butt. So I'm happy to do an Xbox. All the merchant stuff. Sorry. I wasn't thinking. Next time. Capitan. Run in. I'm not getting health regen from the meat. This was a thing that happened before. Maybe it's just not indicating it, but... Oh no, it's working now. Okay. It just doesn't show it until you actually start taking uh, health regen. Alright, I got one. There was only one here, right? Okay. Not to ash and reaches for a dig. For a riddle. Okay. That's what I was thinking more along the lines to set up a game on Xbox, then I'd have to use game chat or maybe, yeah. Yeah, I think a lot of. I, I, I've heard that Microsoft wants to add a Discord app to the Xbox, but I don't know one for sure. I think that may have been just people talking and hoping. It would be very useful because then they could, people could just use the headsets that they have plugged into the Xbox. <coughs> and maybe even be able to bind a push to talk. I'm sure, do you have push to talk for controller, right? For in game, right? Okay, so it's probably you'd be probably be able to do that. One of these times, I want to try and do a uh, because you know how rare we has a. Uh, a rule for themselves when they're doing their live streams like they have to do open mic I didn't realize that was a rule for them but they don't use discord they all only speak in game so I thought that would be an interesting way to play the game as well just completely open mic the entire time and you'd have to um, coordinate with your team beforehand and go radio silent really or have code Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe one time, maybe one session, just do completely open mic. That would be interesting. I'll bring us into the dock over here.
Yeah, Orange Rare does. Although they've stopped doing the live streams, but I remember them talking about that once. It was the one time I actually, because I was like, why aren't they just using Discord? That would be so much easier. And then they pointed out the fact that that's that it's not part of their philosophy when they're doing the live streams. What's interesting is that, and I don't know if they fixed this, for the Xbox, you can't speak in-game if you're in a party. Oh, it's still the same. Lame. All right, find the wooded jetty. That's us. When it's done, read this map. I'm at the wooden jetty. Oh, it's because I wasn't on it. That's a weird requirement. Just said find it. Buoy on the northeast right here. Lantern. Buoy on the northeast. Oh, they made this one easy. Uh, it's almost found to the withered tree northwest. Oh, really? There. Ow! Blended in my face. No. Oh, why are they? Ah. No, the blended. It hurts. Why must you hurt me? Oh, man. They, here, I'll, I'll drag them away and then I'll let you dig. Let me get these guys all on me. And I'll let you... Well, one's following you. It's really tricky. I just need to... Oh, maybe I can... Maybe I'm in the clear now. Digging in an earthquake is fun. Oh, it's gonna go off. You have to head back to the ship. I got the chest. Did you die? All right. You will be remembered. I wish I could come for you, but I can't. Oh, right, let's go. I'm out. Nice to know you. All the good it is. Yeah. When it started quaking, I'm like, oh no. This is the other challenge being a past you have skellies and earthquakes and volcanoes to deal with. Makes the devil roar that much more interesting. Alright, so we gotta go up to Fetcher's Rest now. Oh, we gotta avoid this volcano as well. Well, being picky. But did you die? <laughs> I gotta get those set back up. 
Do I still... Does it still work? Let me see if it still works on my end. <laughs> Gail, these are earthquake and volcanoes. Oh my! Too, I think. A sparkly. They're loud, though. Is that coming through on Discord? I mean, on the uh, in the chat. I mean, in the stream. The sound. I'm assuming it is. To the north. Okay, cool. That's a uh, quoting shark. What do you mean? What was that? <laughs> oh no. You have the wheel, I'll be right back. I need to grab something. One second, everyone. All right, I'm back. Sorry about that. Let me grab a food. Full speed ahead. Yeah. Okay. Oh, there's a shipwreck right here. 
hopefully not in range of this uh, volcano. With our luck, it usually is. Where is it now? I've lost sight of it. Oh yeah, it is definitely in range. <laughs> Let's, yeah, yeah, go check it out. If you want to take the rowboat and uh, just head there and be careful. The minute you're out of the rowboat, it'll start targeting, ta uh, targeting you. Right ahead of us. Where are they? That's weird. Oh, because they're gone now. I don't want to miss out on the fun. Check the way down below. Oh, there's a rare tea over there. Ooh, another grog chest. Nice. Get me. Uh, my crewmate today is Burrito. Burrito forgets. Not sure if that means he's a burrito that forgets he's a burrito or a burrito who forgets just in general. Yeah, I've been trying to get something where a burrito could join. Today just happened to work out. Uh, he's not talking right now. Can you try talking? Uh, you're very soft. Yeah.
Lots of fire bombs down here. There's the fruit. No meat. Come now. Wow. This is another fire bomb, blunder bomb, tease. Just said something you didn't hear. It was very soft. Um, he was coming through earlier, right? Well, I can turn you up. Hold on, it's me, it's me, it's me. Let me turn you up. Try talking again. Can you try talking again? Uh, I, I hear it louder. You hear that in chat? In the stream? Okay, they heard you that time. Yeah, I think it was just too soft. It was getting lost in the game sounds. <clears throat> the, uh, I don't know if you're pulling things in and out. But sometimes it cracks and that's a bit loud. So that was a good stop. Onward. <laughs> We're wrestle with it. It used to be that <clears throat> back when I was using voice meter rather than a go XLR, I was able to create a pretty complex setup to uh, that routed uh, Xbox party into. Oh, that's an empty bottle. Empty barrel. Give me an empty one. Um, Xbox party into Discord and Discord into the Xbox party so people could talk to each other regardless of what. Um, oh, thanks, Shai Tai, the host. Um, regardless of whether they were in an Xbox party or in Discord. It was nice. But I had to stop using voice meter because it was buggy as I was having so many sound problems. side because it's where uh, the chests are um, the 
They're more on the north side. Yeah, Tai Tai repping Gold Hoarder today. We may do some merchant later, but <clears throat> I was going to do merchant, but I figured for somebody joining me, this would probably be more interesting than simply running a ship around. <clears throat> more interesting for them. And I need to get it done anyway, so. But you don't know, I had to start over. Tai Tai. I blame Burrito. <laughs> well, if the, if the worm, like I said, if the worms weren't alive, that'd be, that'd be fine. It's something I hadn't thought of. But I, because I ate worms, because he had the brilliant idea, and it's still possible, I just have to do it a different way. So it's not entirely his fault. I'm the one who decided to say, oh yeah, worms. There's another shipwreck out there. Um, you want to take the rowboat out to that shipwreck while I grab these chests? Alrighty. Uh, but uh, yeah, so eating the worms was against the pacifist thing because you're harming an animal. So yeah, I chat, this morning I was talking with chat because Polish mentioned it. He goes, oh, I thought you were in, weren't going to have worms because you couldn't eat them because they're alive. I'm like... Oh, right. So we discussed the ethics of it and the and the challenge. It was like, I really... I was like, technically, I probably should start over. Which to me is no big deal. You know, I'm not so married to these pirates that I'm like uh, worried about, you know. It is a bummer that I was almost to 40 <laughs> in two factions. <laughs> but, you know, it is what it is. <laughs> don't, 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 don't. You didn't tell me how to get the vomit. You just told... Oh, you did say collect worms, but... Uh, yeah, you see it? It's uh, to the north. It's just uh, just off north there, yeah. This one's over here. Land on a rock. Oh! Uh, I don't know if, if you can get over, yeah. I guess a, a keg skelly spawned on a geyser. The light is fading. I'm going into the darkness. It's too late for me. Yeah, if the, if the worms were dead already, that'd be fine. But you know how it is with this community. You say, I did something totally pacifist. Did you eat a worm? Yes. Then no, you didn't. You harmed another living thing. For vomit, no less. <laughs> it was, a, you know, it's minorly painful, but I've, you know. So we took a little time, found a pirate that was close to what our buff not looked like. Well, that cleared out all those skellies. What? No, no, no. It's not what I wanted. This is what I wanted. This. The shovel of peace. Of course, game. Of course. Put the guys are right under the chest after I dig it. Nope. I'm digging. You get away. You get away. It's my chest. Ooh. Ooh. Look, you did. Oh, landing on the rock. Yeah, I, well, I wanted to land on the rock because it would take less damage. I would end up having... It would be less painful than landing directly on the sand. For some reason, it takes away some of the damage. I think because you're not falling as far. That's why whenever I go in the air, I aim either for the water or for a rock. I guess it makes sense physics-wise, you know? It's, it's a shorter fall.
just above the rock. And the... Maybe here? 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 There we go. Chapter 2. Oh, I did not bring fruit. I was not bringing it. This is a bad idea. It's a bad idea. I always forget that these are crates. Nice. It's a mermaid statue I can't kill. Oh, no, I can't take this one. That's the broken bone one. It's like, yay, Chris Cannonball. No, because I had to pull up my sword and use it in violence, right? Technically. It's about respecting the mermaid culture. I suppose it's a, it's a bit of a... A bit of a stretch, that one, but still. <laughs> you laughing at me? You laughing at me? Oh, am I a clown? Oh, I'm a clown to you? <laughs> I make you laugh. He'd laugh at me. What do you mean you're not taking the statue? Why are you taking the statue? Kill that bastard. Fuck my mates. <laughs> <laughs> what did Mermaid ever do to you? So they help you get back to your boat. You can get back to your boat on your own. I don't need no mermaid for that. I need a mermaid. <laughs> I make a... Uh, I use mermaids for the for their statues. All right, uh, what do we get? Oh, what's the next one? Oh my goodness, it's five dig at Devil's Thirst. Nice. Do you need that? Take a look. If you need it, we'll sell it. I normally I'm just using the fish for meat, but. That's a rare one, so... <clears throat> no, I mean, it, because that's a rare one. That is, like, a rare one. It's not supposed to be rare. I couldn't... I would not sit right with me if you need one. Not to give that to you. take it because I think we're we're right near the sea post. So again, if you check and you need it, we can go by the sea post. We gotta go down to Devil's Thirst anyway. And the Brian's Bazaar is right over here. You take it, you know. You take that black crowd record. You deserve it. Someone say you earned it. No, uh, Ty Ty, the crew can't. If somebody's going to sail with me for this pirate, they have to abide by the pacifist. Otherwise, that would be too easy. I could just say, go kill them for me. <laughs> you go aboard and wreck those people. I'll be over here being pacifist. Because <laughs> that's how pacifism works, right? It's just to go get your hands dirty. <laughs> Like with most things, that's why it's like, it's, 
you know, these sort of playstyle challenges are not for everyone. So I'm like, some people are like, eh, I don't think I'm going to do this anymore. I'm like, that's totally fine. I've had, I had an awkward moment on Shipwrecked. Um, and there's another reason why I don't let, play with randoms. Like I allowed this guy to play and join and I was doing a thing where I was allowing the community to just kind of say, hey, if you sign up, you can play. This guy signed up as a play and uh, he was not enjoying himself but didn't want to leave. <laughs> so it was just really awkward. He was like, I just want to make some gold. I'm like, dude, this is not a way to make... If you want to make a lot of gold, this is not the way to do it. And if you want, if you don't want to, you know, if you want to go find a game and, and earn some gold, then I am not going to be offended. Trust me. He was like, meh. <laughs> Took about an hour before he left, and it was just really awkward. Yeah, again, even... Yeah, this is a... Uh, this is tricky. I thought it was getting him. Said I got a ship. I don't know what that's about. This has been a fairly... I mean, I saw ships earlier, but fairly empty server. What? Jinxed us? <laughs> I like the challenge. You know. Yeah, Tai Tai, we can eat fish in a in the barrel because it's already dead. We just can't fish. Do you need to be on that robot? Okay. What are you doing back here? <laughs> okay, I'm up here. I'll go sit down. No, I'll, I'll take my time out. I'll face the flag. Oh. Ah, oh, man. When pranks go wrong. And you fall off the boat. <laughs> well, you were rowing too fast. You were rowing faster than the rowboat. That's the problem. You got that black crowd wrecker? Okay, cool. Just gonna head over to, uh. Head over to Brian's Bazaar. be missed. So yeah, this is the new Arbuthnot. He looks not too much different from the old Arbuthnot. But it took a while to find this one. As it took to really to find the, the original. But I'm glad we took that extra time. Yeah, I have to start my renown over as well. I was like 40 renown. Back down to 13. <laughs> you should not. Do you want to check, check your hunter's call, see if you need a black cloud wrecker? Oh, 
Okay. Am I near or far sighted? I am far sighted. Although I'm getting the age where I'm probably going to have to get bifocals at some point. I'm getting old. You're nearsighted? Oh, okay. Okay. Ooh, that's a big rock right in front of us. I'll just turn to avoid that. That'll be in everybody's interest. Depost. We are approaching your destination. Please have Black Cloud Wrecker prepared for departure. Imagine if I added to this that if you died, you had to empty your pockets. It's close. Yeah. Well, that's different when you have to abandon a ship. I think it'd be weird, like, where are you going to uh, empty your pockets? Grade one, Hunter of the Black Cloud Wrecker. The train will depart in one minute. And one. Okay. up and see if I can see where this rock is because I know there's a old man in yep indeed I'm um, gonna because I know there's a rock ahead of us just don't know where exactly it is I love the fog the, like the ambient sound for the fog yeah It's off to the right, so I think we should be okay. I think that's Cursewater Shores. Oh, no, that was Flameheart's head. We're, oh, we're going to hit uh, Cursewater Shores. Turn left, left, left. Let me grind it a little bit. A little bit. red gem, but it's just a bit of lava. Hard to port. I wish, you know, I tried early on when I was playing this game to get, you know, the people I played with to say port and starboard. Nobody does. Nobody's up for that kind of nonsense. They're like, I don't know what that is. Oh, yeah. Like, I don't know all the terms for the sections of the boat. Like, I usually get confused on the on the galleon what the name of the back sail is. Like, I know the mainsail. I know the forward sail, but I think in the forward sail is also probably a different name. Starboard is always right. That's the way I usually remember it.
some rubies off in the distance. There's Maro's. We're on track. I think one of the reasons that I want other ships around is because I really do want to steal. Yeah. Yeah, you'd have to be able to... Yeah. Go ahead. Mm hmm There you go. Good name for a future pirate. Good name for a future pirate. Starboard Steve. He's always right. <laughs> majority of these are on the west side of the island, so we'll just go back where we were, kind of on that west bay, for lack of a better term. <clears throat> I'll go dive in. There's nothing to tell. Oh, there's this. I don't think that's, that's the merchant, though. No gold hoarded to touch. Fish. Beans. Any pirate in ancestors? Probably not of mine. For me personally. I mean, sure, somebody has a pirate somewhere in there. Uh, my mom tells me that there's a um, a gang, um, a Western gang member in the Wild West that I was, uh, one of her great uncles was part of. Beyond that, and I don't know how much, sometimes I don't know whether you can trust those things, you know what I mean? The art, the uh, genealogy sites. Good foods. Oh, we have a five digit scurvy. Nice. We'll do that on the next voyage, I think. Next time we're up there. What am I eating? Chicken. Leftover chicken.
Tasty, tasty. Extra tasty now that I can smell again? Yeah. <laughs> What's interesting about meat and a lack of smell is that meat tastes all the same if you can't smell it. Like, savory is just a flavor, so and that's a main flavor of meat. So on certain parts of your tongue, it just tastes like meat. So meat was actually the better thing for me to eat when I had the coronavirus because it actually tasted like, I could actually taste something. Whereas other things just tasted weird. I mean, granted, just savory also tastes kind of weird. It tastes like boiled chicken is what it tastes like. But, uh, can I pick that up? There we go. to be right where we need to be, eh? Don't just stand there. Stand right where you need to dig with your pistol. There we go. Oh, blimey. That was not the right spot. Plain food has to be made with extra flavor so it'll taste the same as it would on the ground because in the air your nose gets right out and they change it. Oh, really? I didn't know that. I'm gonna die. Yeah, a little bit. I got friends. I got friends. What I can say. Oh, did you get that chest? Okay. Oh, I died. They got me. Well, I'm uh, surrounded by violent skellies. I didn't realize that. Yeah, no, that's, uh, let me go. Just let me go. You have only gone from Florida to New York. <laughs> I didn't realize that. I guess that makes sense. Yeah, it was really weird having just a sense of taste and no sense of smell. You realize how much, A, your tongue, the way your tongue works, because your tongue is divided in sections. So some things taste sweet, some things, you know, one part of your tongue tastes the sweet stuff, one part of your tongue tastes the salty stuff. 
then there's one part tastes of savory stuff. It's really weird. while I'm here. What's interesting is like when you get under attack, you get the uh, the attack icon over you. Oh hi! Oh grog chest, lovely. Let me go the other way. Imagine when we get to an emissary quest. <laughs> well, that'll be interesting. On a small island, digging all those chests with all those skellies. <laughs> I didn't get a chance to do that last time. Kind of want to experience it now. It's right here. Right in front of you guys. Isn't that nice? Right in front of you, blunders, galleys. Come on. What are they doing? They ignore. Oh, brig, 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 brig. Uh, just raise anchor and go if you can. No, I'm gonna try and uh I did not see them. They've got their things up, I'm not sure. I'm gonna see if they're on a voyage. They might be in uh They might be doing a um tall tale. Yeah, they're doing heart of fire. Hey buddy, how you doing? You okay in there? They've got somebody in the brig. Why? Why are you in the brig, man? He's sleeping. I'll leave him be. Looks so looks so peaceful. They had to have merged. <laughs> Get deep into her secret. And they got their cannons up. I'll take their chain shot in there. I'll leave the other stuff. We were never here. Um. I won't. Are you by the age of 12 by any chance, Valerian? I don't know what's the, I don't know what they're doing. 
Wow. Um, we can just pick up the chests. That's probably the, the pacifist way to do it. Pick up the chests. I'll go and, uh, we've got all the ones off the beach, right? No, we've got the, we've got the grog chest. Yeah. We can come back to the other side of the island. The guy in the brig was like, I won't tell anyone. Oh, there's a keg here. I'm gonna die. But these guys are like talking like really rudely to one another. I don't even want to repeat what they're saying. You've never seen anyone brig before? I did yeah, or he's or it's an open crew and uh, he was just not behaving the way they wanted to behave. And so they brigged him. And he was just hanging out for the for the gold. I'm gonna be on the uh, southeast side of the island. So basically on the opposite beach from them. Uh, if you come over there by the southeast, we should be out of their range, out of their sight when they uh, come out of the Heart of Fire. I am going to have to have a dig up this chest with some blunders around. Good thing is this... Um, this volcano won't go off while they're here. can't take care of him. I'm like, I'll go take care of him, but I can't. I can get him off of the... Where's this over here? Yeah. Oh, they must have just started. They could have rolled up on us. Who knows? But Whoa! Whoa! Find this other chest. There's that. Oh. Oh. All right. Let's see if we can do this. Ooh, that's a separate gunfire. Is it? Somebody's shooting guns. Let me see if I can get this. Oh, yeah, right, 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 right. Inside the... I'm trying to... It's so hard to focus on where this might be. I got it. Okay. Remember that spot. Okay. Now. Yeah. Actually, I'll show you where it is and because uh, there's a keg skelly. Watch out. It's coming for you. It's coming for you. Keg skelly. Oh, I'm out of health. Uh, I need to grab some health. I missed the dig. And I liked it. What? Oh, almost died. Oops, no, don't want that. Don't want that. Gotta get out of here.
Are they down there? You see skellies? You see... They're coming. Oh, I got it. Come on. Come on, I'm almost there. I got it. Whoa, I'm stuck in a tree. Stuck in a tree. Oh no, I'm stuck. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Oh. I got stuck in a tree. <laughs> Don't try and raise me up because I just grab the chest if you can. Houston, Australia, and with a stop in Salt Lake. That's a long trip. Yeah. I think 14 hours is the longest trip I ever took from San Francisco to London. Jesus, did you drop another voyage down? Okay, do we have another dig here? We have one more we have one riddle here. I'll go grab it. Then we gotta go over to Ashton Reaches. Um is that rig gone? Alright, let me get this riddle. Campfire to the north. That's up top. Yeah, they're still there. But if they were just choosing the door, then um, they aren't anywhere near. North Hanging Cage, six paces south. Ah! They found me. That keg skelly. There's some skellies just hanging out over. Whoa! Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm on a sliver of hell. The, check, uh, the chest is partially dug up there. Yeah. Oh, nope, can't use that. Darn it. I need to go back to the boat. Okay. Okay. Worst launch ever. Well, it's about no violence. about pacifism, right? So no killing skellies. It would just be too easy. Right. You get the chest. Nice. I'll save you. As we go to Ashens, we may want to pick up those chests on the bow and kind of put them back down again. So we don't actually hurt anybody. Again, what are we going to do if there's somebody there? That's the thing. It's like, go! Boo! 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 Shh! Bah! Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Scare them off. <laughs> Bang! Boom! <laughs> Slice! <laughs> Are 
you go. That was funny. I don't know, those kids. I don't think they were kids. They were talking about, what are you, 12? They were doing that kind of talk. And... Well, it wasn't, yeah, it was all text, so it was, uh... Yeah, I don't know, can you see text, even if you're an Xbox party? Mm. Gotcha. Choose another page. I'm repeating the music. Oh, I'm going to hit the island. Sorry, I was looking away. <laughs> Stakes were made. for yet. Well, that scarecrow's up here, I think. Paces east. This is why you don't sail distracted. <laughs> you can't, you can see the text on it. Okay. So if you're in a party, you're cool. That didn't sound good. <laughs> Come on. All right, I got the chest. Next we have two at Flintlock. We have a riddle and a dig. Just two, three chests total, including the riddle. Oh no, one is, I'm sorry, the other is Fetchers. We have a riddle on Flintlock and a dig on Fetchers. I think what we can do is, I'll hop off at Flintlock and um, get that one with the rowboat. 
And then I'll row over to Scorch and I'll meet you at Scorch Pass because we have a five dig there as a message in the bottle. We have a one dig at Glowstone K, which we can get later. <coughs> it wasn't my fault. Nope. Say, if they just run over the things, you know, that's their fault. He's starboard Pete. This went up with the loot. I hope nobody's in this pile of loot. Otherwise, we'll just be angry with you really irate and I might shake my fist at you now if there was somebody in there they would have uh, they wouldn't have let us leave once they saw what it was on board they wouldn't have given us a chance to turn in yeah oh it's a rock Another shipwreck here. Let's go swing by this. We'll leave the. We'll just pick up and drop the uh, bounty chest, just to get the streamer out of the sky. But we don't want to go with a, a marker on our head for. It's be a while before we head over to Reapers. Contraband. I didn't mean to. And I tell you, I keep instinctively going to the ammo crate to reload. <laughs> it's just still. I mean, because I it, no. I mean, because I think it because I also play other pirates. I'm not strictly doing this. That uh, I think that instinct is always going to be there. I see a sloop. Just scully sloop to the east. The shipwreck. You just realized what his name was? Orange. What is it? Because I, I was trying to figure that out. I don't under, I don't know his what his name. Oh, weren't you glad? Oh, now I feel dumb. <laughs> aren't you glad you didn't know that before? No, I, I totally wish I did. I think the one for the L is what threw me. I was like, orangey, orangey ad, orange. Orange, and for a moment, my, my brain went to orange Julius. <laughs> yeah. That is a great name though. here too. What we got in these barrels? Ooh, blue gem. I'll go over and grab those and swim them over. Looks like the barrels themselves sink. 
Oh, you got it? Oh, grab it. Come here, you. You're mine. Grade four. Soon we'll be with that infamous grade five. And no one will be able to stop us. You're OG Xbox Live guy. I kind of regret changing my name. I would have five letter name I had I never. Oh, really? Nice. Rig is still at Devil's Thirst. Into my pockets. Actually, I don't need into my pockets. Tea bags. <laughs> that was your original? That's hilarious. Yeah, you probably should have stuck with that. Oh, I see. That might have been what? All right. Yeah, I, I put a bunch, I put a, a blue gem and a uh, skull in the treasure chest. There are sharks. Watch out for the shark. You got two sharks behind you. That's unfortunate. Oh, they're going to bite you. Ow. What's happening with your headset? Is it like. Because it like bangs. Oh, oh I see. Because it's clonking every time and it's it's like really loud. Probably not. <laughs> Eventually, now that I'm going to start doing this with Xbox, because I think there are a lot more people that I may want to play with it, or Xbox only, that uh, I'll I'll get a filter on it. I'll route it to its own channel in in OBS and add a filter. It won't be so bad. Uh, yeah, let's 
ちからするCheck something. I'm inspecting a package. Oh, it's delivered. Hold on. One second. I've got something being delivered. My girlfriend's going to go downstairs to see if it's down there. Usually they're good about bringing it up to the apartment, but I didn't hear anything. But it's weird, as they said, if they put it in my mailbox, but this is a, an item it won't fit in my mailbox, so I don't know what they mean. Oh, yeah, um, hold on. Sorry, I'm distracted by this. I've got, it's like an expensive item. I want to make sure that it's there. Touch the touch the gem and stuff if you can't pick it up and the gold that way we get some uh, grade for it. Oh, there's more here. Lovely. It's like oh you couldn't pick it up there, so we'll just give you more here. A gem and a piece of gold. I'll 
take the riddle here. Oh, and it's a uh, dig here, sorry. Dig here, riddle at Flintlock. I was supposed to go to Flintlock. Oh, shoot, I forgot. Crapioca. Oh, kegs, kegs, kegs! We're gonna. Um, I'll row down to Flintlock. That way. All right. I'm afraid to drop the robo with this. Okay, here. Stay away. Stay away, go away. You go away. All right, it's anti. Here we go. Fare thee well, me Juliana. Shallow, shallow brown. I fare thee well, me Juliana. Shallow, shallow brown. Or it's shallow in Just as the day be dawning, shallow, shallow brown. And my ship she leaves tomorrow, shallow, shallow brown. And it fills my heart with sorrow, shallow, shallow brown. Oh, hold on a second. Hello? Oh. My girlfriend leaving to go check downstairs. For a pirate sails to thieves sea. Shallow, shallow brown. Nice, though I never will deceive ye. Shallow, shallow brown. For you are my one true treasure, shallow, shallow brown. I fill my heart with pleasure, shallow, shallow brown. So fare thee well, me Juliana, shallow, shallow brown. I fare thee well, me Juliana, shallow, shallow brown. There you go. Candy! I think could have turned off the music for that. Yeah, I got some new lights. This pretty much is what I'm waiting on. I got some uh, a pair of Elgato key lights, and uh, which is why I'm like, they better be down there. Those definitely won't fit in my mailbox.
Free chest. I like it. Nice. I think we're resting at the shipwreck. Great. Way over there. Uh, let's go ahead and head over to Scorch Pass. I think the volcano just stopped, so it should be good there. And I'll just meet you there. I should be done with this too sweet. We got a free captain's chest. We're getting a lot of grog chests. This RNG is much preferable to last week's. <laughs> last week was a bear. Not far from here. Remember the last shipwreck I saw you got sunk and then got reared. Yeah. Oh yeah. No last shipwreck I didn't get sunk. I just got reared. I got uh, food hit regged and then killed and I lost everything. I sunk somebody almost twice. Then I got killed. Um, after thinking I'd eaten some food, but apparently no. And then, uh, then I got merged. That was, that was, yep. That was, uh, very painful. <laughs> My entire day's worth of loot. Gone. Eight hours. Eight hours of, you know... Fighting and uh, I wish I'd won that first fight, that two ship fight at the very beginning. Oh, that would have been good. With the two sloops at Dagger Tooth. Let's get this out of the way. Eight paces northeast. Oh, you got you got slooped. Oh. oh, oh. Probably a sloop. Let me check. Two pace. Eight paces north by northeast. Well, this should get us to grade five. Big bucks? Yeah, both. Okay. From Amazon? Okay. I'll take a look in a minute as soon as I get back on the boat. Thank you for going down. Was that? Oh, really? I didn't know there were old mailboxes. One was not for us. One was not for us. Okay. Oh, gotcha.
Thank you. Yep. Um, yeah, I mean, it sucks to uh, to have that happen, but it, it's it's again, it's part of the challenge of shipwrecks. You run the risk of losing everything if you lose. You know, especially at the end, I also didn't have to go after this sloop that would have sunk us a, uh, a skelly sloop with all my loot on board. I got a little overconfident, and I never should have hopped off his boat. If I had hopped off his boat, I could have handled him again, sunk him again, because I sank him the first time. They came back, the they came back quickly because as I learned afterwards, you want to light the keg before you depth charge them. Otherwise, they get a, an environmental spawn, which is closer. So they were back in a couple minutes. And um, I kegged them again, and I was in the process of fighting them on the ship. And uh, I hopped off, thought I ate a, a pomegranate, but didn't, so I was half health, and I got sniped. And insult to injury, I, got, I, I was at... Um, that was over just off of Isle of Last Words, in between Isle of Last Words and Daggertooth. And I got a uh, Sanctuary Outpost spawn. I'm like, okay, okay, it's gonna take them a while to get that loot and it's gonna take them a while for it to turn it in so I can get back to them. Raised anchor, started sailing, merged. Went back and they were gone. And they were probably not merged like I was because they were off the boat getting the loot. They had one person off their boat getting the loot onto the rowboat or whatever, so they didn't merge. So when I came back, it was, uh, it wasn't a good situation. Well, I'm excited. I got both these lights. Hopefully my lighting situation will be a much better. It's not bad now, but it's requiring three lights. I'm hoping this will solve the two lights and it'll be less, um, it'll be nicer because this is homemade stuff that I've gotten that I'm using for my lighting situation right now. Stuff I got at the hardware store. Alright, I'm halfway there. I'm just getting up by the volcano. <laughs> no problem, he's mashing the, count the controller. Isn't kegging skellies a bit violent for a passive guy? I'm not kegging skellies. That was, I think we're talking about two different things. We're talking about shipwrecked, um, which is a different series than the, than the pacifist pirate, but we're not kegging skellies. And with the other thing, it was, I was actually uh, kegging a player sloop. Oh yeah, no worries. That looks good. I mean, I've got a, like, I've got a custom LUT that I made. Um, so I think for what I have, it's about as good as it can get. And it's not bad. I think it would be nice and even and probably easier on my eyes if, uh, if I had, when I hook up these key lights. And I'll just the room will look better because right now it just looks like a mess of these weird lights with uh, wax paper over them. <laughs> look a little more professional. And should I ever need to, which I doubt because I have a green screen, I can always change the color of them, do all sorts of things. back so I was blocking the beautiful boat in the background of my webcam. All right, I'm here. I'm ready to dig chests. <laughs> oh, just in time. That volcano is going to erupt. Bring the boat around.
No, they're right here. Oh, you got them all? Or... Oh, gotcha. I'll put them in the rowboat. Think about it. Don't even think about it. Don't. Okay. I'm like hopping off in between things so it doesn't target me. Ah. Oh, that doesn't look good. Okay. Nice. That was gonna hit me. More. All right, I'll meet you on the other side of the island. Coming around now. Hey, hey, okay. Imagine swimming through this. I when I swam, when I swam the entire map, I was like, when I got to the roar, it was insane. Because I was dodging lava bombs and sharks. <laughs> I want to do it again. Yeah. It was one of those things I was, it was shark week and they were doing the shark um, appreciation. And uh, my thing with I was already calculating with this pirate because he's my shipless pirate. How many, um, nice. Okay, let's head to Maru's. Um, how many, uh, what you call it? Well, you know what we can do? We're going to do the emissary. So we might as well just head up to, um, what you call it? Uh, galleons, yeah. And um, I was two hours into the stream of killing sharks, and I thought, but I had a boat. You know, I was using a rowboat, so I'm like, I can't really say I'm killing a lot of sharks if I'm using a rowboat where I'm not encountering as many sharks. So um, I said, well, what if I want to, I'll just swim. And I said, well, why don't I just swim the entire map? I was two hours already into the stream saying, why don't I do that? It took me 19 hours. It was crazy. I died three times. I probably. I do. I want. I do. I want to do it again and record it though. I didn't record that. I mean, it's not a stream vod, but I didn't. Uh, it didn't stay. You need a lot of disk space to record a. 19 hour stream. Well, that's right, Shipless Pirate Legend. Indeed. That is where Tai Tai made his appearance on my stream for the first time in chat. Those are the final moments of that. My uh, Shipless Pirate becoming a legend. We believe the first Pirate Legend without a ship. Entirely without a ship. And I think this will be the first pacifist pirate. I don't think anybody's ever done this before. See, some people like to stack a bunch of loot and say, go for the record amount of loot. And I try and do <laughs> stupid things that are really hard. That's true. Exactly. We're all set up. Oh, where are we going? Let's go. To, let's go to Shores of Gold. <laughs> uh, 
I don't see anything. Oh, yeah, we got to go head due west. Yeah, not northwest. I see, see the sea post is already south of us. Uh, three paces east, so. Just head due west. Yeah, there she is. They did raise up the, um, what you call it? The Red Sea, the border of the Red Sea. Yeah, you have to, you used to have to, um, sail southwest from Galleon's Grave to avoid being in the Red Sea. I mean, southeast. But now it's just, yeah, they pulled that corner out. So now it's just due west to Galleon's Grave. Perfect. Uh-huh. Primary dip. Yeah, they did. I think, yeah, Rare, Rare, Rare did that. I was also kind of in a, because I was already, I'd been doing uh, the Shipless Pirate for about a year, and then Alactar decided he wanted to be the first to reach Pirate Legend without a ship, and I was like, ho, 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 hold my beer. I worked way too long on this to not be the first. And he did things different. He had the... Uh, I wasn't really... He had people ferry him places. I'm like, that's, you know, that's not shipless. That's taxis. But, you know. We have a galleon to the south and a... An emissary galleon and a sloop going after it, I think. 